Hello folks, my name is Cass, one of the nurse practitioners at Titan Medical Center. Today I wanted to speak to you about Hercules Potion. Some of the key ingredients, L-citrulline, L-arginine, these increase vasodilation, help you with the focused pump when you're training and exercising. L-carnitine, which helps fat metabolism, can help you lose weight. In addition to that, has glutamine, proline, lysine, which also help with recovery, antioxidants, decrease muscle soreness. It also has NAC, taurine, and ornithine. These all help with making your workouts longer and more productive, and also anti-aging properties as well. So I wanted to talk about collateral circulation pertaining mostly to the heart. So the heart is fed blood through vessels. Now when there is a blockage, it's called a heart attack or an occlusion. So if this were to happen, blood cannot be sent to the heart and the tissue can be damaged. However, we have something called collateral circulation, which are micro vessels that can feed the heart and supply some oxygen and blood to the heart, which can buy you time potentially to get to the hospital and get help from a doctor. Can we make it better? Can we improve it, make it stronger? The answer is research shows you can. This is achieved by training to failure, heavy exercise. And with using a product like Hercules Potion, you can train harder and potentially improve your collateral circulation and possibly develop new ones. So not only can Hercules Potion help you look good, feel good, and train strong, but you can also potentially help yourself later on in life if you were to have a heart attack. If you're interested in learning more about Hercules Potion and other Titan Medical Center therapies, please give me a call. I would love to hear from you and help you achieve your goals. I can be reached at 727-389-3220. Stay strong and stay healthy. What's up guys, it's Big Drew with Titan Medical. I'm here with John, we're at LA Fitness. No more scoops anymore, this is all I'm taking for pre-workout right here. It's a new high dose ECA cap. No scoops, no nothing, just put it in. Give me 20 minutes and I'm ready to go. That easy. Titan Medical, let's go, let's go, let's do it. Like you, you, eat you, you eat an hour and nine minutes before you train because you have to have food and an food workout. Yeah. You can eat. You can go right into rest, it. Pop on the way to the gym. Like I, feel, I don't feel like I ate it. It's good. You know that heartburn from the BCAs and the, I'm telling you, man.
Hey guys, today I want to talk to you about Titan Complete. I get a lot of questions about Titan Complete. It's a signature vitamin amino acid injectable blend that we have here at Titan Medical Center, specifically and exclusively for our patients. It actually combines two signature blends that we had before, Titan Up and Titan Strong. We combine these two to make it easier for our patients to inject one time and get the benefits of both therapies. So, what's in Titan Complete and how's it gonna help you? The first one is methionine. Second one is inositol. Third one's choline. B1 through B6, so your B complex. B12, all three of the branch chain amino acids, leucine, isoleucine, and valine. It also has L-carnitine. So what are the benefits of these ingredients and how are they gonna help you? So MYC, methionine, inositol, and choline are gonna help with processing fats in the liver faster, getting those fats out of the liver, helping boost the metabolism. B-complex is gonna be great for a number of different things, for energy, for hair, for skin, for nails, for immune function, for blood cell count. These are some great benefits just with the B-complex. B12 is gonna help utilize fats and carbohydrates and turn them into energy for you guys. The branch chain amino acids, the essential amino acids. That means your body cannot produce them. You have to get them from an outside source, okay? These are gonna be great for one, not going into a catabolic effect, right? And having your muscle breakdown. It's gonna be great for brain function. It's also gonna be great for utilizing and mobilizing fats in the body. So it's gonna be great for weight loss effect along with the other components. You also have L-carnitine. And l carnitine is in almost every cell in our body. And it's going to help out with more energy. So you can boost and rev that metabolism even more and more naturally because of these are things that your body needs. Now, I also get a lot of questions. Can I get this straight from a diet? Can if I just eat? The answer is yes. But who out there has a perfect diet that thinks they're getting all these things in? I have a pretty good diet and not even myself can get all these things in that I need. So that's why I do the injectable version. That's why our patients do it. It's going to deliver all these things that your body needs in one simple little injection within 45 seconds to a minute. It's that simple and you get all the benefits out of it. Okay, so Titan Complete, one of our signature vitamin amino acid injectable therapies here at Titan Medical Center. If you want more information about it or want to read up on it, go to TitanMedicalCenter.com. If you want to become a patient or would like us to discuss it with you, please call or text 727-389-3220. I'm John from Titan, guys, and thank you for tuning in. Hey guys, John here from Titan. I'm with Drew, and uh, we are going over some of the preliminaries of his labs that just came in. So it's real simple and real easy to become a patient with Titan Medical Center, especially if you want to check out what's going on on the inside and not just on the outside, like your you know your, your organs, your liver, your kidneys, your hormones, um, like free and total testosterone levels, thyroid levels. You want to make sure potassium levels are good white blood cell count, red blood cell count, hemoglobin, hematocrit, prostate for guys, B12, IGF-1 levels, and all these different things that make your body tick, tock, and go round and round each day. So at that point, the first thing we did was had Drew come in, we had him do some blood work for preliminary, and we got some of these different things back from the test. He's gonna have a consult with his medical provider here very shortly. I was just in here to say hi as a personal friend and just gonna go over some of the different things that he's seeing here. So Drew, you got some of the results in your hands? As I, I do, I definitely do, and I'm really glad that I actually came in and uh, hooked up with you guys to go through this. Um, as we mentioned before, I've been coming off of a very long, very stretched out contest prep diet, um, pushing the extremes of weight loss, and this is something that I think a lot of people go through. Right. I don't think it necessarily uh, applies strictly to physique competitors, I think it applies to all athletes. Or and people in general. People, really, yeah. any gym goers, anybody trying to better themselves, you know, 
try and find me one person in the world that says they don't want to drop five pounds. I mean, right. it's pretty tough. We all want to trim up a little bit. Yeah, but, absolutely. You know, people tend to push the limits and people tend to be extremists, myself included. And I, I just pushed this uh, prep out a little too long and I pushed a little too hard on the gas. And what ended up coming back is now we know exactly what we're dealing with and what right. we have to fix. Right. Uh, in my particular case, I mean, there are a couple things like my, uh, my blood cell count, like my uh, hormones, my testosterone, my estradiol were slightly off and I had a feeling they were because I felt a little funky, you know, a little right. bit of fatigue, it just didn't feel right, my strength was dropping a little bit, which again is very common. Right. And then, um, you know, furthermore, we dug into some stuff like my potassium levels were pretty elevated, right. which is unfortunately a very common and missed situation with a lot of bodybuilders yeah. particularly. And in some cases, I mean, it can be very dangerous, I mean, in some Absolutely. cases it can be fatal. So it's one of those things where, I mean, not only did uh, they get me right into my blood work, as soon as the results came back, they did it all in-house. And as soon as the results came back, I got a call from John, just giving me a heads up what was going on, a few things that we might want to retest just to be sure about. And it's just, um, you know, I was telling John this morning, I've been ranting about the service here, and it's just that you're not swept under the rug, which is huge. So you want to make sure that whatever provider you're going with is taking care of you as a person, putting your health first. That's the reason we're doing this. So within two days, I got all my numbers back. We know pretty much what we have to do about Absolutely. it now. So we're gonna sit down with the doctor and go over the specifics of it. And this is step one, guys, to get yourself right. That's the thing. Um, talk to any competitive bodybuilder and the ones that know what they're doing that have been around for a while are gonna tell you that blood work is key. Absolutely. The ones that don't, that might be a little ignorant to the process, are gonna ask you what blood work is. This is the map of what's going on inside your body. So if you want to perfect your rebound and make the, make the most of this optimal time to build muscle and yeah, absolutely. Healthy, not lose everything. You need to know what's going on. And then even more important than that, to make sure that you're safe and that you're healthy and that you continue to bodybuild and diet and train right. and live the life you want to live and live your best life. You want to know that these things aren't red flagging on you. And if, you, if they are, fix them. Absolutely, I tell people that all the time. Health should be your own priority to you guys. Whether you're a bodybuilder or you're a regular person, just day to day, quality of life and health is number one. So without your health, you're not getting on stage, you're not gonna do that photo shoot, you're not going to the beach, you're not hanging out with your loved ones. It's really, really important. And it's sometimes you don't know what's going on, on the inside until you blood test. You know, I mean, some of your organs could be messed up. I mean, there could be some different things that you could fix if you get to it fast enough and get to the problem and, and do what you need to do. So we're gonna continue this on. We're going to schedule Drew to come in to sit with the provider, kind of videotape that, how it goes down, so you guys can see that behind the scenes, see kind of what goes on, so you guys can see what a tight medical center patient goes through in the process. And then at that point, if you guys need any help, you guys can always call or text us at 727-389-3220. So stay tuned for Drew and his consultation with the medical provider. We'll see you guys soon. What's up guys, John here and Sharice and we're back with another Cupid's Corner. So this week, you know, we were thinking, you know, all this, this stuff going on outside that, you know, relationships get stronger, obviously on an emotional basis, but on a physical basis too. So we were trying to think like, how can we help our viewers out there 
increase their bedroom enhancement mm -hmm. right? or you know relationship enhancement in right. the bedroom right. so because i don't think we've really talked about bedroom stuff yet no yeah no. we have to keep it super pc yes because of abc yes <laughs> Yes, yes. So with our show being on here, obviously there's certain things that we can talk about and certain things we can't. But you guys could probably get the unrated version on our YouTube channel. So go to Titan Medical Center on YouTube and subscribe there and get all the goodies, okay? But we're going to talk about PT-141, sildenafil, and oxytocin, which is one of our awesome libido-enhancing or bedroom-enhancing therapies mm -hmm. called Cupid's Candy. So we thought it was fitting because it's called Cupid's Candy and this is Cupid's Corner. So it kind of goes hand in hand, right? A little bit. Plus we're talking about relationship advice and what's good for a male and female and what can they take together to enhance their bedroom activity, okay, mm -hmm. or performance. And you don't necessarily need a performance booster, but who doesn't like to be their best? Yeah, I think everybody gets a little, what's the word I'm looking for when they're... You know, they don't want to, they, they think they're fine. Like, I'm totally fine. Oh, yeah. Nothing's, nothing. Denial. Fine. Not even denial. Maybe you are fine. Maybe you are rocking it in the bedroom. Oh, true that. But sometimes you don't know you could be better right. or it could be better right. until you have better. So yeah. until you have better, you don't know that yeah. there's a better that exists, if there that makes sense. There could be optimal levels. And, yeah. And we talk about this all the time. Optimal feeling, uh, you know, and so these are things that, and you guys can, this is more of a bonding experience too, because you guys can both take this therapy together and you guys can both get the benefits of it. So let's kind of talk about what is Cupid's candy. So Cupid's <laughs> candy has three main ingredients in it. It has bromeldetide, it has oxytocin, and it has sildenafil. So these three things, let's talk about bromaldehyde or PT-141. So this is a libido enhancer and actually it's FDA approved mm -hmm. for females um, in an injection version. Now we can do an injectable or we have an oral version that you could take in. And how it works, it works on the nervous system, okay? And this works for females and males, um, for libido enhancement, for more sensitivity, um, just for an overall more pleasurable experience. Because they always forget about the females, that yeah. we have to have some pleasure too. Yeah. You can't just automatically assume that we're pleasured. Absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> and females do, you know, they do suffer problems of not being able to reach orgasm yeah. or have libido function, um, you know. So at this point, it just depend. It doesn't matter what your age is from, you know, 21 all the way up to 61 or whatever it is maybe, mm -hmm. right? You guys can all use this and all benefit from it. Now, formerly, you know, there was a lot of libido enhancements for males. Right. So we talk about sildenafil, which, you know, is the main ingredient or chemical in Viagra. So, and how this works is it works on the vascular system. So it works by vasodilation and blood flow and it takes it down to the extremities. And this works for males and females too as well as far as that goes. Mm -hmm. That one's my favorite, I think. Yes. So, you know, so, so guys can get this, females can get this, and they can get it separate. They can get all these different ones separate that we're talking about. But we're talking about a combination of these mm -hmm. and working together to make a more pleasurable experience, you know, than one of them. So Viagra, which is sildenafil in this, right? And we have PT-141, which is bromaldehyde, And these both work on vascular and they work on the nervous system. And these work together to give you better stimulation, libido effect, better better pleasurable experience in the bedroom for both of you guys. Mm -hmm. Now the last ingredient or last thing that's in this is oxytocin. So oxytocin is, uh, it's used and it gives spasms to uh, the uterus in there. So at that point, what this can do though, so oxytocin is the chemical for, it's the hormone that bonds, it's the yeah. bonding hormone, okay? And that makes you come together. So you guys can lower inhibition together, you guys can come together and you guys, you know, can have a better bonding experience and sexual pleasure like this, right? A bedroom enhancing experience. So both of you guys can take this, you guys can come together, you guys might talk about things that maybe you haven't. Or you may not have to. normally talked about. Um, it might open you up a little bit more to be able to communicate with your significant other on maybe something that you would like or yeah. it could lead into a regular conversation Absolutely. that would lead into something that's intimate yeah so you guys will get a lot of benefit from this i mean you guys will be able to talk about things hopefully 
um, in the bedroom and maybe out of the bedroom experiences or thing that's going on. But when you're in that, I guess, heat of the moment, you're going to be hopefully talking about things that you guys are getting pleasure out of, right? <laughs> you know, because, you know, guys, oh, we don't want it. Like, oh, let's talk about this now. Let's, let's uh, you know, let's have some fun and then we'll talk about this later. But it just opens things up. And then maybe in those pleasurable experiences, there's things that you guys want to experience more together. Mm -hmm. And this will open that up, maybe. Maybe it's something that you were insecure about or, or didn't want to talk about. And this just opens the door. So when you're getting all three of these things, so you're going to get the vascular system, like I said, with sildenafil. You're going to get the nervous system with bromeldetide, PT-141. And you're going to have a more bonding experience or more pleasurable orgasms for females and males. Um, with all three of these ingredients combined and working together, it's like the ultimate experience as far as that goes. Right? Yeah, a hundred percent. And you guys have to remember, I mean, personally, and I'll share this with you guys, I think it's important for you guys to be intimate at least. And I know that everybody's busy. Everybody has full-time jobs. Yeah. You got kids, you have businesses, you have things you have to do, laundry, whatever it is, mm -hmm. guys, girls, it doesn't matter. Right? Everybody's busy, mm -hmm. but you got to make time for each other. It doesn't matter when, mm -hmm. but it's got to, I mean, I, I'll say for you guys, it has to be at least twice a week. Right. It has to be a minimum of twice a week. Sometimes I hear these stories about these people that are, you know, married. Let's just say yeah. they're married for five years, right? Yeah. And I'm talking to them and, you know, it's like once or twice a month. And I don't feel that that Yikes. is, me personally, I don't feel that, and this is coming from, you know, us, we're a successful marriage mm -hmm. up to this day and we will be forever. Yep. John's not going anywhere. You know, <laughs> I told him that nothing but 10 feet under, but anyways, um, it's important for you guys to do that because I don't think that once a month or twice a month is enough to really be intimate with one another. And I really think you guys can disconnect like that. So try to make it at least twice a week. I think that's minimum, you know? Me and John, you know, well, pers me, per me and personally, it's, you know, we try to make it every day yeah, or yeah. every other day. I think that's been the key to our marriage Yeah, is, is the everyday thing. Yeah, I think so. I really think so. It's good. No, I think so. It's good. I think you have to do that. So females out there, just take tips, you know, yeah. you really, really like your husband. You want to keep him around. This is what you got to do. And male's the same thing. You want to push your wife too, right? You want to make sure that she's happy or your girlfriend or whoever it is. Um, and you guys are having these, that's a bonding experience, you know mm -hmm. I mean? You guys are together, you guys are, you know, as one, right? Uh, and at that point, you know, you guys don't want to grow apart and this can really keep things together. Um, even if you're fighting and stuff like that, try to put some things aside as long as it's nothing too serious and, and, and bond. I mean, you guys should be bonding emotionally, physically, mentally, and all, all three of these things. And I really do think that each thing's a big part of the relationship. Mm -hmm. um, they're all vital, I think, you know? So at that point, it's something you got to work at too. Don't become complacent. Um, and forget about these different things that made your relationship successful, mm -hmm. all right? So yeah, so we just covered Cupid's Candy, which has bromeldetide, PT-141, it has sildenafil, it has oxytocin. You guys can get this awesome therapy from us here at Type Medical Center. Our medical providers would be happy to go over uh, more about this different therapy. Um, and we have a whole bunch of other therapies that may be helping you guys. If you guys aren't feeling in the mood, right, all the time, uh, and, and you know you just don't want to do this and, and you did before I, I, I truly believe like you know if you still love your significant other that you want to please them and you might just be forgetting about it or there might be other things going on like hormones or something like that I was gonna say I had to give I had to drop something in that's this just episode a whole different, that's a whole different I've got to at least say it though because a lot I think a lot of females forget that we also need libido yeah. and just to give you guys some education yeah. us females also need some testosterone we don't need a lot we just need a splash, but we need some of it. And, I, and that's kind of one of the things that If you're really, deficient or lower. Right? Yeah, I mean, okay. you get blood tested. You see where you're at. See okay. if you need it. I think, honestly, 90% of the population has a deficiency in testosterone. Okay. I don't normally see testosterone levels that come back very good. So, I mean, I'm back here in the clinical portion of this, and I see blood tests all day long. So... You know, I think that people forget that. So just remember that we have testosterone and it is about a harmonic balance between all the hormones. So even if your estrogens are off, I mean, it can cause a lot of different things and just, it will definitely put you in, not in the mood Absolutely. or, you know, maybe some other physical things going on mm -hmm. where maybe you don't feel comfortable. So maybe you should get your hormones checked too, you know? Yeah. And don't think you need to be 50 years old to get your hormones right. checked. I mean, I'm 33 and I've had a hormonal imbalance at 34, 33. 
Wait, I forgot. Who cares? I like just being 30. I'm going to say I'm 30. But anyways, <laughs> <laughs> I'm 30, right? And um, I've had a hormonal imbalance since yeah. I was 17, yeah. if you can believe that or not. Hence the reason I have such a passion for what we do here at Titan. So um, I want you guys to just keep that in mind because you don't want to just put a Band-Aid on a bleeding wound. This is good stuff. Oh, yeah. I mean, you could you could use this every night. For sure. But, you Probably know, make you happier, too. It probably will. It probably will. Um, but, you know, you always want to make sure you fix the underlying condition if there is one. Absolutely. Absolutely. And we'll talk more about that in another episode. So, guys, we appreciate you guys tuning in for Cupid's Corner. It's been an awesome week for you guys, so I appreciate it. Um, and make sure you guys are checking out our YouTube channel. There's a whole bunch of other content that we cover in there that you guys would probably like or benefit from or educate yourselves in some other different ways, and maybe we can help you guys out. So if you guys do need or want some help in this different area, all you guys got to do is call or text us at 727-389-3220, and we will get you either a telemedicine visit or you can come in the office, talk to one of our medical providers, and take advantage of this great therapy even together or one of you guys mm -hmm. okay so i appreciate you guys tuning in thank you very much i'm sharice i'm john and we'll see you next week on cupid's corner see ya